think they're going to be similar to Welsh. Um, you know, you show, they showed against Gloucester that they uh, throw the ball around a lot. You know, 32-8 was it against a good Gloucester team. Um, so they'll be coming down here, you know, full of it, and hopefully we can match them there. And obviously we've just trained out there, and it's been very sharp. So hopefully we can throw the ball around as well. Uh, make sure our forwards are spot on as well up front because it could be one up front as well. They've got relatively nothing to play for, although Steve Diamond would obviously uh, would obviously disagree. Do you think that makes them potentially dangerous then, because they can play with that freedom? I think they're dangerous anyway. Um, you know, they've got great players all over the park. Uh, you know, as you said, they've got nothing to lose. They're coming down here to play, and we've got everything to lose. We desperately want to win this game and go that extra yard. So we've got to not focus on what, what they're bringing down, and we've got to focus on you know the weeks ahead. But first and foremost, it's playing against Sale and getting four points and, and marching into the semis, hopefully. You mentioned that yourself, that a win this weekend will just about get you there, almost certainly get you there. How important is it that you get it done before you go to the stoop? I think it's massively important, you know, in front of a home crowd, you know, last game of the season and hopefully in front of the sellout crowd, you know, we have some, in, you know, we probably owe the fans a, a good performance this weekend and hopefully we can go out there and do that. Brian, an emotional weekend for you coming up for your last home game at the Giants? Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's coming close to the end, it's going to be, it's going to be a good game. Does, what's it going to mean to you though, running out, as, as you have done so many times, uh, Gardens, knowing this could be your last time? Um, I mean, it's going to be special. Uh, it's I've, I've been here, you know, I've been here a while. Um, I, I've played a fair amount of games for this club, and it, you know, hopefully, it won't be too emotional. But uh, it's going to be good. Obviously, it isn't the end for you with Saints. You've got at least one or, or one after this, maybe more. We hope. But your final Franklin's Gardens game. What, what will your favourite memory be of your time playing at the Gardens? Uh, I don't know. There's there's too many. Um, it's a special place. I mean, I've played I've played at, at you know I played in South Africa and and it's it's, it's different. But uh, I mean, here yeah, for me, it's you know, people have been very kind to me. People have been very welcoming to me. So um, it'll really be sad to leave. And the fans are very taken to you. Your, the the mood chance will obviously live long in your memory. Uh, yeah, I mean, I've had I've had one or two good days here. Yeah, I suppose uh, it's 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 been a special time in my career.